Hi all folks, this is Max from um, RootKindleFire.com So I'm going to show you how to root your Kindle Fire on a Mac or Linux, alright? First what you'll do is um, <clears throat> what you'll do is hit up here, hit more and uh, go to device and make sure allow install of installation is on like that, alright? And also connect a USB cable to your computer. Let me do it again. Do it like this. Alright, and then um, disconnect. Hit disconnect and leave it aside. And uh, you're gonna go download. Um, let me see. Download. Where's my download folder? Go download. Um, Kindle Fire Root Mat Linux .zip. I'll have links below um, on my blog post. And uh, if you open that up, um, you'll find a bunch of files. All right. Um, what you want to do is uh, you'll want to copy this file adb underscore usb dot ini. Um, you can do copy. Right click copy. And go to your user directory. Usually it's, for me, it's Max. Um, on on a, a Mac, it should be similar. And uh, here, oh, actually, you know what? Actually, let's do it. Open up a shell, actually, terminal. Because it won't show you the hidden folders. And you're going to go browse to the directory where you unzip the folders to. Mine is, I just do CD downloads. And then if I do ls, it'll show me the files, and then I can just go into um, Kindle Fire root Mac, Mac Linux, right? All right. And then here's what you're gonna type: mkdir and uh, slash dot android. This is gonna make a folder called dot android in your user directory, which you need. Oh, whoops! You can do uh, try to do sudo for for. Um, for Ubuntu, right? And then enter my password there. And then what you're gonna do is uh, type cp. Um, you might want to do sudo. Sudo is for a super user on Ubuntu, but you don't. You might not have to do it. Do sudo cp um, adb underscore usb dot ini, and then do slash or the thingy and dot android slash like that. I don't know me. Ah. This basically copies over this um, USB so it'll recognize your Kindle Fire. Alright, once that's done, uh, all we're gonna do is sudo um, sudo sh run me um, linux.sh for Mac to change that run me mac.sh and then this should start um, rooting your Kindle Fire. So it's working. And um, now you can uh, root your Kindle Fire on a Linux or Mac. And uh, if you do root it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Um, I would highly appreciate it and tell your friends with Kindle Fire about my site rootkindlefire.com I would really thank you for that as you can see now it's rebooting reboot it so it should be rooted whoops press extra numbers there and uh, when it's rooted um, we should be all good to go and I'll have a video on how to unroot it also um, so I don't know. So it says, um, all done, Kindle Fire rooted. Don't worry about the error message, that's fine. Um, so we'll go and check out, check it out real quick here. And um, should be all rooted. Go check that you have super user, and you don't need this data anymore. here more and go to applications 
and go to all applications and you should have super users somewhere down here super user there you go there you go so now you've rooted um, have fun with it I'll have another video on how to install APK files uh, for those of you who don't know and uh, I'll have more hacks so check it out all at um, rootkindlefire.com Alright, thanks y'all. Subscribe.